What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. And here we are once again at my solar farm. So today we're going to try to kind of tweak this out to get as close to 300% as I can. If I go into my electricity, we are, well, it's not showing it, but we are at 300% overclock. But I want to fill up this third and final plot here. If I go into them, we can see GPU 1 and 2 is full. It's mining away. Main, that's where I'm at right now, is has some space. So I want to put in some cards here. And plot power here is loaded up on only power. So I want to fill this up and then, again, like get as close to 300% as we can. We have about a week until the following Sunday. The update happened yesterday. So I guess we've got about six days until the next update. So we don't know if we'll actually see an update or not. Speculate but we got a week so I'm gonna tweak it out and if we don't have an update then I guess I'm just tweaked out longer I don't have to worry about removing everything but Fudweiser here did message me and he found one of the new secret codes and that is G3HU so I'm gonna come into here the codes here we're gonna put it in and see what it actually does so G3HU and we're gonna redeem this and we receive blue particle reactor V2 so what is that let's find out that kind of sounds like it'd be a power supply, uh, potentially. So we're going to go to electricity. Wrong one. We're going to go to build here. Uh, electricity, blue particle, accelerator, V something. Is it in here somewhere? I don't, I don't know. Fusion reactor, particle reactor, V2. Oh, right here. Right here. Okay. So it's a power supply. It's based on the same model as the previous version before the update, which used to be the best. But it does the same as the solar panels but it is okay so it's a lot bigger obviously so we're way better off we could fit four of the other ones to one of these but it's something to have so if you need some power put in that code and then you could legitly run an entire solaris farm and then some you could run three and three quarter plots loaded with solaris gpus off this one power supply so that definitely give you a solaris boost if you're still in the solaris department so use that code again g3hu and you will get a pretty darn good power supply here you know for especially for all you guys just starting off i don't know if there's any level requirements or anything for that code but that's a pretty darn good code actually especially for all you newer people out there all right, so looks like the algo just changed. So let's see where we're at here. 1.5. Let's rock that one. So this is I blah, 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 sorry about that. So this is about I think maximize where I'm at right now. Remember one plot I could fit a few more racks on. So we'll probably have to drop one or two and put power. But right now I'm at 298% overclocking with this about a quarter full and just over half here on the power on this plot and then my other plots you like this one for an example we'll go look at plot four here this is loaded up right full of a solar panels i guess for solar paneling it up free power that's the way you gotta mine crypto in real life you need solar because then you don't have any expenses when it comes to power and that's your biggest uh, expense is power when it comes to crypto mining but regardless this is a game so you don't have to really worry about that aspect of this but this is the solar farm plot uh, GPU plot 2. This is my big one right here. Load it up. Load it up. And it... Sometime today. Come on. There we go. So this one's loaded up here. Loaded up with GPUs. As you can see, uh, plot 2 is also... Or plot 1, I guess, is loaded up. And then we got our main plot, which is the one we just finished working on. So I think I pretty much maximize this. Again, there is a little bit of tweak I can do, which involves pulling one part uh, plot right apart and then kind of fine tuning the adjustments there just for like one or two racks to squeeze in. It's not really worth it, especially if another update does come soon. But I'm pretty happy with this. I think this is good. I'm going to remain at this type of operation until the next update comes out. When that happens, I have no idea. It could be Sunday coming up. It could be in two weeks. could be in a month. We have no idea, but we'll wait to see what happens. And when a new update comes, you know, there's going to be different power. There's probably going to be different GPUs. And we'll just have to change everything all over again. But until then, right now, we're good. Good, good, good. All right. So thank you for checking this out, guys. Let everyone know about the Rabbit Gaming YouTube channel. I'll see you on the next one. Hit that subscribe button. Rabbit out.